Neil Vanderstelt, author of Global Economic Collapse, The New Dark Ages. Man, oh man, it just keeps getting weirder. Everywhere you look, there's some type of control mechanism. Some weird, powerful person controls the groups you're in. It controls something in your life. They control your banking. They control your resources. They control the information you get on the news. And yes, they control social, social media too. Facebook owner Mark Zuckerberg is David Rockefeller's grandson. David Rockefeller's grandson. Wow. Posted by Space Wabbit. I did not mispronounce that. They spelt it W A B B I T, Space Wabbit. <laughs> On February 22nd, 2015. Thank you for making me say that word. Now I cannot speak anymore. Facebook bans Dave Hodges for daring to expose what's behind the murders of the bankers. Move over, John Rapp Rappaport and Michael Rivero. Dave Hodges joins you as the latest victim of Facebook's censorship. Facebook has banned my participation. I am and have been outspoken critic of Facebook and its intrusive violations of privacy. However, it was a way to enlighten people as to the current state of our uh, country and world. Why is it that I can't say simple words like our? I always mess up on that word. Our. Just say our. 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 Then I can't say the next word if I pronounce it right. Our. Like hourglass. I'm having technical difficulties. Excuse me, I'm having technical difficulties. I can't read the word our. Facebook did not list the reason as to why they banned me. I only posted articles to groups for which I was a member. This is not a violation of Facebook's rules and is clearly a cause of flagrant censorship. There's a typo there. That's why I'm stepping over a word. It says of flagrant, flagrant of censorship. I kid you not. And what was I writing about? I have been writing about the rash of dead bankers and who is behind the killings. It is no accident that Facebook owner Mark Zuckerberg is David Rockefeller's grandson, who controls one of the biggest banking interests on the planet. I'm disgusted. <laughs> oh, God, I feel like crying right now. I'm not kidding you. I, I'm just so sick of it. I'm so sick of these elites. I'm so sick of it, how much money and control they have, and they're just stomping on all of our rights and limiting everything we can do. Oh, geez. It is important to have social groups to spread the word. I will be in search for a Facebook alter alternative and will be publishing alternatives on this site. Mark Zuckerberg, Zuckerberg is Jacob Greensburg. Is Jacob Greenberg is grandson of David Rockefeller. Not a complete sentence exactly, is it? Mark Zuckerberg is Jacob Greensburg, grandson of David Rockefeller, I believe it should say. And there's a link here, so I guess that goes to another article. TAP Facebook was funded with 500 million. Oh, wow. Facebook was funded with 500 million dollars from C a CIA owned bank which was a bit suspicious <laughs> it's, a, it's a bit suspicious that the CIA owns a bank isn't it what are they doing using drug money Zuckerberg means sugar mountain that's their secret word for Facebook no doubt a mountain of information from which they can extract billions Bill Gates comes from a multi-billionaire eugenist family, which was kept well hidden in the early years of Microsoft. The same families control it. Yet, is this story true? And then there's a link to that story. I'll provide a link to this article in the information section of the video. 
it has been revealed that Mark Zuckerberg is the grandson of David Rockefeller. His true name is Jacob Greenberg. Oh, okay, I get it. Also grandson to Hank Greenberg. He is royalty. Some police records show Jacob Greenberg was arrested for possession of marijuana when a much younger man. His mugshot was taken, which looks like a younger Facebook icon with 99% reliability. It was later revealed that this could indeed be the man the world known, knows as Mark Zuckerberg. Also, the Rothschilds own 8% of Facebook shares. The hidden agenda for Facebook social network is to aid the growth of the police state and one world government movement. According to the TAP blog, the venture Facebook was funded with $500 million from a CIA-owned bank. One can only wonder if the other giant Google has similar disguised progeny. The adopted name Zuckerberg means Sugar Mountain in German. And then there's another link. Zuckerberg is David Rockefeller's grandson, Clinton grandson of J.D. Rockefeller. And there's another link. Facebook, a product of the New World Order Demon Clan. Another link. New World Order, Facebook. Mark Zuckerberg is revealed by the TAP blog. His two grandfathers are David Rockefeller and Maurice Hank Greenberg of AIG fame. He has an agenda in service to the cabal. Camelot has many branches in American royalty. Mark Zuckerberg, founder of Facebook. It has been revealed that Mark Zuckerberg is the grandson of David Rockefeller. His true name is Jacob Greensburg, also grandson to Hank Greenberg. He is royalty. We already seen this as you're repeating stuff, I guess. Okay, I've already read all that. So I'm going to drop down and see if there's any more important information. Amazing. Here's some comments under this. Replies. It says, the jackass would like to add some other famous family lines. Jimmy Carter was fathered by Joe Kennedy Sr. Thus, he is half-brother to John, Robert, and Edward from Camelot. It means that Miss Lillian, the mother, was Joe's secretary, with more than dictation being that by the woman when under the elder elder's employ. Jeez, speak English. That explains why Jimmy was never why Jimmy never had a father revealed during his presidency. Wow. Not to be outdone, William Jefferson Clinton is great is great grandson to J D Rockefeller, the oil mag magnate. Bill Clinton was selected. Due to his penchant, oh, technical difficulties, I cannot pronounce the word. Technical difficulties. Potion. Po what? Come on. Penchant. Penchant. Who the hell used penchant in a sentence? What kind of sentence is that? Penchant for bond fraud. What kind of person used pen penchant in a sentence talking about a subject like this? Bill Clinton was selected due to his penchant for bond fraud and keen interest in cocaine binges. After his select election and residence to the Ar Arkansas Governor Mansion, the Air Force Base near to Little Rock had its runway lengthened threefold by the CIA. It then it was then suitable to accommodate the larger aircraft that transported nar narcotics to Panama. The hidden Camelot US royalty of elite scum goes on. 
Yes, I'm all aware about that. In fact, I'm uh, friends on Facebook with, uh, oh, Daniel Hopsaker wrote the book and also documentaries about the uh, CIA being involved in uh, drugs and uh, the Clinton family and the Bushes are also involved in that. And there's a long list of people. Uh, they killed Barry Seal. Barry Seal was also a drug runner who allegedly knew the... Uh, knew the killer of JFK, you know, the real killer, not Lee Harvey. Um, Lee Harvey may have been there, and then again, he may not have been there, but, you know, anyone that believes that the guy shot at the JFK at a limo at a bad angle, moving away from that building, and was able to hit him several times, not only from the back, but from the front, because remember, his head, his head goes back, and... Uh, this uh, I hate to say this, but his brains got spread out in the back of the limo, which was to the back of where Lee Harvey Oswald, Oswald was allegedly at, which makes so, no sense because if he was shot from the front, or if he was shot from the back, rather, the uh, particles of the bullet exiting from the front of his head, which it, that's not what happened. It exited through the back and he, you know, his body parts went on the trunk of the limo and his wife picked up the body parts and tried to put him back together, so to speak. Instead, um, not instead, but, you know, that would have went to the front of the limo, in other words. So the shooter that shot him in the head there's probably more than one shooter. The shooter that shot him in the head was clearly in the front. And me personally, I believe that the shooter of JFK was in the, um, there was a little gutter, you know, drain drain gutter, that the shooter was there right in front of the limo and had a perfect uh, kill zone, so to speak. And it wasn't in the grassy knoll, like they say, because that would have been right out in the open, but he was hidden in the gutter and then the gutter system, I believe, had an exit that went out to a uh, uh, a wash and actually had reports that there was a guy in the wash there that had a gun. Dallas police didn't actually investigate it. So, amazing, isn't it? They also killed a CIA man, the same Dallas police. His name was Carnegie. So there's a lot of conspiracy going on with the Dallas police and stuff to do with JFK and the CIA a long history of this weird stuff going on and that's how they take care of people who uh, you know betray them so to speak JFK himself was elected by the mafia and perhaps they saw it as betrayal when he decided decide to make the government more transparent and JFK was actually trying to change the monetary policy to uh, probably make that more transparent as well so any more comments well there's another comment but uh not real important so anyway uh this is neil vanderstel author of global economic collapse the new dark ages available on amazon um this is a uh website which i'll put the link in the information section of this video about uh Mark Zuckerberg actually being related to David Rockefeller. He, you know, most people associate with being one of the people involved with the New World Order. Thanks for listening.